Hey guys, welcome back. So we're doing another watch along for One Piece today, episode number 85, and I just read the title, so I might as well share it with you. An outcast dream. Here look the quack. So I don't I don't know what that means, but I don't really consider that too spoilery. It's got a, a character name in there that I don't recognize. But um yeah, as you know, I, I try to avoid <laughs> reading the titles because they, they do give away a lot of the plot, but that doesn't seem too bad. So last week was um Blue Nose Reindeer Chopper's Secret, where we learned more about Chopper and what is going on with him. He ate a human human fruit and became half human, so now he can change his form at, at any time and become like a, a, a humanoid, but kind of still beastly looking. And that does put a lot of people off and, and they get scared of him. So he hasn't really found his place in the reindeer world or well, the human world because the reindeers have rejected him as well. So the poor little guy needs a home. And he's been invited to join the crew by Luffy and Nami because he's got these abilities and he's he's medically trained. So obviously they're very keen for him to, to join the ship. So we'll see what happens. I'm pretty sure he does because, because like I said, I've got the manga boxes over there and he's all over them. So I, I know he's kind of going to be joining, but that's fine. Seeing how it all plays out is part of the fun. So... I can't believe I read the title. I've got them just there on top of my file, so it's, yeah, it just popped in there. So anyway, guys, let's just watch the episode. So as I mentioned, this is a watch-along format, so grab your copy, watch along. We we'll also have a Patreon with early and exclusive release content, stuff that is not yet released on YouTube, and I do do things, I do do things a bit differently over on Patreon. I'm really struggling today, can you tell? And you'll find a link to that down below with all my socials like TikTok and Instagram and Twitter. All right, let's do this. Three, two, one, go. I look like a grandfather right now. I've got a blanket over my legs because it's like seven degrees in Sydney. It's very, very chilly and cold. And my nose has been dripping like a tap. But the show must go on. Ugh. So I'm, I love that we're, um, well, I'm assuming we're going to learn more about Chopper in this one. He seems to be very caring because there was a scene in the previous episode where Sanji and Luffy were going to close the door and Chopper freaked out and then they found there was a little family of birds living on top of the door frame and if they had closed the door, the birds would have been, well, squished? Probably not squished, they would have, they would have fallen off or flown away. But Chopper's main concern was making sure those birds were okay so he wouldn't let them close the door. So he's a very caring and kind individual. I'm pretty sure he's going to have a, a, a wonderful bedside matter. He's cute. And he can fight. Like he gets he gets big and scary. So he's going to be um a wonderful addition to the team. It's hilarious that Nami got sick. Because she had some kind of like a, a tick or a parasite on her. From the previous island. And the witch doctor's like. Were you running around half naked? Because that would be stupid. And then we had all those scenes <laughs> where she's just in a bikini top. She's like, oh, that was funny. The whole show's funny. It's just wonderful. Don't judge me. My My Hero Academia mug. It's, it's losing some of its... Uh, some of the paintwork's come off. I made the mistake of putting it in the dishwasher for the first couple of washes and um yeah not dishwasher proof what a shame and my one piece mug has um cracked here look I don't need to look away today here look the quack what is that is it a another doctor are they have they stopped trying to eat him oh my god he's Peter Parker <laughs> cool. Stop trying to eat him, Luffy. He's not... Don't call him a monster. He's just as, as much of a monster as, as you are. He's tickling him. This is not cool. <laughs> oh, I love Luffy. I really, really like you. I'm not going to eat you, I promise. 
Chopper's not experienced with friends. And I never wanted a friend? Yeah, you do. Oh, he's very good at catching stuff. I'm going to make you become my friend. Well, Luffy has a habit of doing that though, right? Thank you, Sanji-kun. That was English. Oh, shh. Doctorine. Oh. <laughs> oh. He's still chasing him around the castle. Flashback. Oh, the outcast guy. Here, look. Oh, okay. This is going to be an emotional journey, guys. You ready? Oh, bloody Wapol. So here a look is being hunted. Oh, he's not well. Blood? Oh, no. He's coughing blood up. Not a good sign. Uh. Here's the quack. Wow. <laughs> oh dear. His doctor's briefcase has a skull on the front of it. Okay. The one doctor they don't want to see. I'll pay you to leave. <laughs> oh, he's terrified. <laughs> I've got a family. Yeah. Oh, he turned him into a frog? Apparently. Oh. Where's the patient? He hopped away. It's not easy being green. I'm sorry, I couldn't help it. Okay. They're Dr. Hunt. The worst of the quacks. Yeah, yeah. And he's going to run into Chopper in the wilderness. Oh, 
and they're gonna bond. Maybe he's gonna help him in some way. He's found Chopper. Oh, he's in human mode. It's a Yeti. Oh, he's freaking out. An ointment for broken bones? I don't think that would work. Poor Chopper. Oh, he got shot. Oh shit. Beating the doctor up. He's huge. The tranquilizer gun? No. No, the doctor is out cold. Literally, it looks freezing. This isn't this isn't helping me. I'm really cold today too. I'm feeling this blizzard. What the heck? And I can hang my clothes off my Johnson. <laughs> Impressive. Oh, this is his first time with a human, not trying to kill him, and a doctor. Bread roll and some milk. I like the sound effects for his um, little footsteps. It's weird. Oh, he's crying. <laughs> he's so he's such a sweet, endearing little character. Red line, grand line. Just read the signpost for the first time. <laughs> I can talk. Run. <laughs> Oh no. Wait, is this the is this the castle? Oh. Ah, <laughs> oh, slapstick. Oh. <laughs> Why are you calling me Chopper? Tony Tony Chopper. This is how he got his name. Tony, Tony Chopper. Tony? <laughs> he never had a name before. How does he get his hair like that? Terrified patience. Lizard, I, oh, oh, did he turn somebody into a lizard? And Chopper is still running away from humans. 
You're the decoy. <laughs> mean. Oh, he's on the side of the um the mountain. Best of friends. Oh, he just got a hat. He got his hat. The hat. Oh. Cool. And I'll never take it off. Oh, so the, the antlers went right through. I didn't even recognize that he was wearing it beforehand. So his, his, his heart's in the right place. A flashback within the flashback. We're going into an inception territory right now, guys. You're completely healthy. What happened to him? He's coughing up blood, right? Right. That's why he has it on his case. He's gonna die. Right. Okay. See? Makes sense. He's just so easily distracted. What a pirate. Oh, don't eat the plate, Luffy. How... how He's a rubber man, he can fit all the food in his cheeks. Oh, he's starting to sell it. Singing, dancing pirates. Adventures. It's cool to be a pirate. The good times passed in the twinkling of an eye. This is where it gets sad. Oh no. Hmm. 
one year. Thank you, Doctor. Out you go. The end. Bye. He's just kicked him out. That's heartless. Oh, I don't have any friends. I have no place to go. Oh. If did he fall? Oh no, he jumped. Oh. Bloody hell, man. So mean. Oh. <laughs> oh, forgive me. I thought they were going to kill him off. They very well might still yet. We've still got some time, like two minutes. I'm going to die. Yeah. Oh. Coughing of the blood. Oh no. Oh, he's hearing it. It was him. He was the man that was cured. Oh, cool. This gardening, landscaping that made him happy and he was cured, but he's not cured. It doesn't have a happy ending. Is this going to be continued? Ah, oh, mofo. I knew it. I was like, wait, there's only like a minute left and we still got credits. An, out an outcast dreams. An outcast dream. Here, look at the quack. I liked him. He was insane. I like the bond and the relationship between him and, and Chopper. So he, he basically he basically kicked Chopper out because he I guess he doesn't want Chopper watching him die. So he let him go. Chopper's flashbacks are heartbreaking. Tony Tony Chopper. Chopper, go out to sea someday. You will, you will real, you will realize how small your fears and worries really are. We saw him get his hat. Uh, 
and stop okay yeah that was nice like um they're really giving the character of chopper some justice with these very in-depth emotional flashbacks really kind of fleshing out who he is as a character why he is where he is emotionally and location wise so it's it's interesting to see what happens with him in regards to the other characters so yeah we've got a real kind of um we're developing a real emotional attachment to this character in pretty much two episodes like his humanity how he was an outcast he was only accepted by one doctor who was <laughs> a little bit eccentric and crazy um their relationship had an expiry date because the doctor was dying and the grief of being kicked out so i don't know what's gonna or i do kind of know what's gonna happen in the next one because it seems pretty obvious the doctor is gonna die and then chopper ends up with uh korea korea carrier the old lady doctor who's hot she's she and and then obviously he's being told that you know pirates are awesome go out to sea one day and see the world the last kind of um great words from here here look here look yeah here look i got it i'm fine so yeah it's um I'll, i love the way that one piece can kind of pluck at the heartstrings like this for all the the hijinks and the shenanigans and the comedy and all the fighting it really has kind of slowed down its pace a little bit just to get a, a bit of a, an emotional wallop and introduce a, a, a fan favorite this new character which i'm really excited to see become part of the team and get to know tony tony dropper very cool so we learned how he got, so he we learned how he got his name and his hat awesome so anyway it's time for some hunter hunter so please if you like my videos consider leaving a like and maybe subscribing I also have a link down below for my patreon where i have exclusive content not yet seen on youtube and a whole bunch of other stuff and my socials are also linked down below okay catch you next time thanks for watching